Hi parents, thank you for checking out this tutorial. I'm Elaine from Great Solution, Jimmy Math. In this video, I will be showing you how to draw basic unit models for primary 4 math. A unit model is a model that consists of equal units and it involves two or more parties. Keywords to look out for are as many as, a number as much, or words like twice or thrice that describes the relation between two or more parties. Using two questions from past year SA2 papers, I will show you how drawing models can help us visualize the question better and solve it with ease. The first question is taken from Catholic High School and it is worth 4 marks. Ali, Raja and Peter have 208 marbles. Peter has 27 more marbles than Ali. Raja has thrice of what Peter has. How many marbles does Ali have? The keyword here is thrice. Thrice means three times. That means Raja has three times as many marbles as Peter. Therefore, Raja would have three units on his model, while Peter would have one unit. Now, since Peter has 27 more marbles than Ali, that would mean Ali's unit is less than one full unit by 27. So let's go ahead and draw the model. Raja would have three units. And Peter would have one full unit. Okay, as agreed, Ali would have 27 less than one full unit. So we draw a shorter bar here. And we indicate that this excess part would be 27. And let's go ahead to fill in the other important information, which is the total of 208. And of course, the question mark. How many marbles does Ali have? So the question mark would be here. From here, let's also identify the equal units, which is basically what Raja and Peter have. Now looking at this model, it is clear that we have four equal units and one part here that is 27 less than one unit. In order to split these units up equally, we need to make Ali's part one full unit. And how do we do that? We simply add 27 such that he has one unit like Peter. So let's go ahead and add 27 to the total. And that would give us 235. What that means is 235 is 5 equal units now that Ali has 1 full unit. So 5u equals 235. 1 unit would be 235 divide by 5, and that would give us 47. How many marbles does Ali have? Ali has 27 less than 1u. So let's go ahead and subtract 27 from 47. And the answer would be 20. And that's the solution to this question. The next question is taken from CHIJ St. Nicholas Girls School and it is worth 4 marks. Jill saves $612. She saves 6 times as much as her brother, Tom. How much must she give Tom so that both of them have an equal amount of money? The key word is of course 6 times as much as that puts Jill at 6 units and her brother Tom at 1 unit. So let's go ahead and draw the model and then decide how we can split them into two equal parts. So we have 6 units for Jill. And 
and one unit for Tom. Jill has six hundred and twelve dollars. We know that the total is seven units and what we are trying to do is to split this seven units into two equal parts. So let's go ahead and find out how much they have all together. Since six units is $612, one unit would be 612 divided by six and that would give us 102. So this is the amount that Tom has. And we can include this in the model. Now let's work out how much they have all together. So 102 times 7 would give us $714. For them to have an equal amount of money, we have to split 714 into two equal parts. So 714 divide by 2 and that would give us 357. Since Tom already has $102, the amount of money that Jill has to give Tom is 357 minus 102 and that will give us 255. And that is our answer to this question. I hope this tutorial was easy to follow and is helpful in showing you how to draw basic unit models. In the next tutorial, I will be showing you how to draw before and after models. So stay tuned to our channel. If you have any questions for me or have any suggestions as to what topics you'd like to see in upcoming videos, please feel free to leave a comment in the comment section below and also subscribe to this channel for more free tutorials.